Yo, what's up guys, and welcome to another LEGO video, at LEGO Videos 4. So, for today's video, we're going to be taking a detailed look at the Hogwarts Express from Harry Potter. This is, it's number 75955, ages 8 to 14, has 801 pieces. So... I will not be showing the minifigs, but I will be showing them during the review. So like in the middle of the review, you would most likely see them. So first, let's start off with the train station. So hold up a moment. So as you can see, we have this person. I forgot who it was. But, you know, just someone from the movie. And then we have this like really nice clock, which is my favorite part of it. It's my grand, my grandpa, rest in peace. Used to love clocks, so just saying that for his honor. So then we have this like baggage carrier thingy, and then we like to do. I always liked the Lego train stations, like when they like um, go on top of the tracks like this. Like the tracks would be like right there. And don't worry, I will definitely get some videos of this thing motorized. I just have to get a motor. And then, you know, there's all these other things on the station, like, you know, a head thing on the lamp. Looks like a head. But apparently it's not, it's just a lamp. So now let's get to the most important part, so you guys can... Hang on one moment. Just trying to get a good review for you guys. Actually, right now. Never mind. Alright, so we have the locomotive here. It has this bell, and I think that's a bell. I don't know what I don't know which one is which, but I'm pretty sure that, that is the whistle and this is the bell. I'm not sure though, so. I always really like to see these things in action like that. You will soon be able to see that. So then I'm pretty sure I just put a minifigure in there to drive. I don't know who it is, just like someone from the movie. Then the tender is where that it can like slightly open up. And I'm pretty sure if you want to custom motorize it, I'm pretty sure the motor is supposed to go inside the tender. And then the train car, the roof can actually be accessible because, you know, all trains can do that, Lego trains. So, I wanted to put some more minifigures in it, but this is the only one I could get that can actually sit down without you, without using its, you know, tiny legs that can't sit down. So, yeah. So, let's get this thing back on so take a look at that logo really nice oh wait, maybe this thing is the whistle I'm not sure but yeah so also you know there's H stickers you know there's like there was like so much stickers in this set too if I remember correctly when I was building it so yeah well, that's going to do it for today's review. It's my fourth LEGO video on the channel, but it's the first single set review. So I'm going to do, so that's how this video is going to end, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace!